Welcome back to Chef Buck's Cajun Kitchen. Chef Buck here, another successful trip. Shout out to my boy Sporting Art. We went to Louisiana, fished a little bit of the Texas waters, really on the Louisiana side. Came back with some big redfish, a couple flounders, a gar, little baby trout. It was a successful day. It was kind of slow at the beginning. Ended up coming home with the monsters. Shout out Bookie Woods, came back with the biggest redfish. Shout out you Pops, you know, that's where I learned it from. And you know, we had a good time out there. It was a little hot. But, you know, we overcame that. Persistence paid off, and we came back with them trophies. So y'all keep tuning in, keep subscribing, and y'all got a treat today. I'm going to stuff the flounder with some seafood boudin, drill some secret sauce on top. I'm going to bake the redfish. It's going to be fire. Sorry y'all can't be here, but keep subscribing. They don't, they don't rock right on the edge. Right. Wait for the main rocks. Wait for the main rocks. Gar, big gar. Yes, sir. Nice flounder for your boy. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Let's get it. On the live stream. Nice. Yes, sir. How about another gar? We do this, baby. What you got? What, what you got? got a gar. It's a gar. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Okay, we got one here. We got one coming in hot over here. Whoa, 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 look whoa, whoa. Oh, 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 what's the good one? Oh, 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 oh. Good mark, good mark. Hey, there we go. I put my pole down in front of you. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We back to back, we back to back. Oh, yes, sir. Right yes, here, sir. Right. That's good. Back to back like the comic. Oh, shit. This motherfucker. Pull your rod tip up. I'm trying to bend it on you. Shit. I got him. I got him. He's right here. All right, here we are. Big red, big red, just hey, landed. How's that feel? We got a double. We had a double, double on hey, right double here. Double hookup, baby. That's what we're talking about, right? Make the thing go right. Hey, Amen. We in Louisiana with it. Right across the state border from Texas, baby. We out here. Let's get it. Let's get it. Turn on right now. What do you think, Ellis? Uh -huh. How was that fight? <laughs> yes, sir. We eating good, baby. We eating good. Right. Hold on, I ain't getting no video of that. No. No, that's recording. Woo! Hey, we in the spot now. Yes, sir. I'm video them. No, he got me all tangled up right here. Yes, on. sir. Let him go. Let him go. Yes. all day. Holes bending all day. Rips. You know what I'm saying? We rip lips all day, you know. We in the Come Louisiana on, the waters. Right up in here. Big reds, we got gar on the boat, we got flounder. Come on now, we just we just do everything. We catch everything. Let's get them, let's get them art, let's get them art. Is he a keeper? He's cool. Yep, he's a keeper. Yes, sir. That's how we do it, folks. Yes, sir. Right here. Fishing with sporting art. Nice pretty red, baby. Nice pretty red, baby. Half shell filet. Y'all gonna see it. Y'all gonna see it. We gonna eat them real good. Real good. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Get them in the. If he needs to go to that side, then just let him go. Watch yourself, Alex. I see. Watch yourself, I see. Alex. I see. Come on. Yeah. This way. This way. Watch your motor. 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 Back up, Wood. <laughs> Reel down. Reel down. I can't. I'm trying to get away from the motor. Get his ass, Art. Let me get in there. Get his ass, Art. <laughs> yes, sir. Fuck the yeah, pole. Take the pole. Take the pole. 
Don't be so scared. There you go. Ew! <laughs> <laughs> See, man, tear them up, boys. Ripping lips, boys. Tag on I ain't gonna lie. It's a tag on that motherfucker. It was a great day. Tore them up, baby. Sporting art. Let's get it. All right. Half shell, redfish on the half shell at its best. That's Don't good. get no pressure in that. Good shit, good shit. All right, we're back at Chef Booker's Cajun Kitchen. Got the fresh flounder right here, nice and scaled and gutted already. Got our redfish on the half shell. And we're gonna go ahead and get started. I'm gonna show you how to cut the flounder in the middle so I can stuff it with this seafood boudin. What you do is get a very sharp knife. You need to sharpen it so good, very sharp. You don't wanna cut yourself though. And there's a line right here down the middle of the flounder. You can kinda see it. Let's go right down that line. That's where the spine is. I'm going to cut right down the middle. Just like that. Go back through it just in case. Boom. All right, see, I'm, I'm in the middle now. See, if you... The spine is right there. What you want to do is get your knife and just cut that bone right there. Where the, where the meat is. You just go all the way down. There's an extra piece of bone up here. You want to just go ahead and meet it down there. Then you want to do it on both sides. It's basically a fillet off the bone. It's basically what I'm doing, as you see. See how that opens up right there? Look at all that meat. It just opens right up. Get our stuff in nice and good. Nice and good. Nice and good. We just cut it all the way. So you get to that top dorsal fin. See where you see my knife right there? I'm gonna get all that meat off the bone right here. Look at that. Look at that. Perfect. Perfect. This is all bone. This is all meat. Look at that. Let's go over it a couple times to make sure you got it correct. You wanna do that for both sides? All right, so I filleted it pretty good off the bone as you see. Look at that meat. This is the bone right here. Look at that. Stuff it real good. I did it on both sides. So I'm going to go ahead and do next is you get the scissors and you want to cut. Just cut that bone right up. Simple. So we went ahead and cut that out with the scissors, as you see. You know, it looks pretty perfect to me. Not much meat left on there. That's how you want to do it. We got a nice pocket right here. We're going to stuff that with the seafood boudin, flip it back over. It's going to be a stuffed flounder right there. For you. We're going to go ahead and stuff the flounder now. We got our secret seasoning on there. It's four different seasonings. I can get out of this pretty soon. We're going to have our own seasoning containers for sale. Get it out of us in about a week or so. Yeah, nice season on there. Don't want to do it too heavy. Don't want to be too salty. We're gonna go ahead and stuff him there with some seafood boudin. All my customers that know that seafood boudin, they know it's fire. Crawfish, shrimp, and crab meat, baby. And green onion. We'll go ahead and stuff him nice and good. Get that nice in there. Man, we're gonna close him up just like that. Just like that. Look at that pocket. Look at that. Hooey. Look at that, people. 
Then you always want to season the outside of the fish because we season the inside. And then, you know, when you get that first bite, you want to go ahead and that top bite have a season on it. He's scaled, so you can eat this right here, the skin and everything. It's all good. So, yeah, got the nice pocket right there, nice and stuffed. Stuff that in there. And we're going to put them in the oven for about 25, 30 minutes. So a flounder is really lean and it'll dry out real easy. So you want to use a lot of butter, a lot of butter. I'm going to just go ahead and stick them in there, right there on top. So when it melts real good, it'll keep our fish nice and moist and keep that flavor intact. You don't want it to get dry, like I said. It's a real lean fish, the meat's real lean. So I'm gonna just grab a little butter here. Use real butter, not margarine, by the way. Go ahead and stick that under there. It'll get that meat nice and ripe for you. Don't worry, it looks unhealthy. You'll be all right for a day, it'll be fine. You could, for all the people on diets out there, you could cheat one day, eat this five course meal, five star meal, you know. We're gonna go ahead and put them in the oven. All right, nice and seasoned on the outside. Got our stuffing in there. All the bones are gone. Seafood Buddha inside, seasoned inside. Look at that, beautiful. We're gonna go ahead and put them in the oven. Just let it do its thing. And now we're gonna move to the redfish, right this way, right this way. See, this is a redfish on the half shell. Half shell basically means he filleted right off the bone, kept the scales and the skin on the outside. We can bake it and just eat it right off that, off that shell. You ain't even got to pick on it, nothing. You just eat it right out. It comes right off. So we're going to show you how to do that next. So this is our side. We got fresh asparagus. If y'all have my salmon place before, you know how that asparagus hit. Just put a little butter on there. Let that melt real good, real good. I really don't even let it melt all the way. I let it continue to cook as I throw the um, asparagus on there. So that's pretty good. Go ahead and drop them bad boys on there just like that. You, you don't want your fire too high. You can put it like on medium. Because if you have it too high, it'll turn black. Everything's about presentation and flavor. So I want that flavor to be right. And then as the key, the key for this is some garlic. I'm going to sprinkle it all over them. All over. Not too much garlic, though. You don't want to overdo the flavor. And last but not least... Tony Satris, the key to the key to cooking down south. I'm gonna season that real good, real good. And let him do his thing. Check back about five minutes, flip them over. You know, simple. So to serve the stuffed flounder, you just want to just cut down the whole body. See, I already cut one already, so I'm going to just go ahead and scoop him up. Look at that. Perfect. Look at that. Perfecto. Good Lord. Fire. That. So this is our... Um, what should I call this? Of uh, hundred million, five hundred million dollar sauce? I don't know. It's something million dollar secret sauce. There you go. That's the real name. We're gonna go ahead and drizzle it on there. That's the that's the killer right there. If y'all wanna know what's in the secret sauce, y'all can go ahead and uh, give that up. We're never giving it up. I'm sorry. All right, we got our taste testers here. Let's go ahead and bite into that. We'll know what we think. Yeah, it's good. It's fire. It's good. It's real oh, yeah. good. It's good, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It is good. 
Like that asparagus too. That's special too. Like that. Oh yeah. That is like that's rest, it. Like some restaurant shit. Yeah, like that's it. That's good. Mm. Yeah, this is not a cheap meal. Yeah. I like that. Mm-hmm. Season actually, well. I actually never had flounder before. Really? We need to start. We need to start getting this so good. Great. And it's stuffed with boudin. Seafood boudin. Boudin. Yes, it's, it's real good. Yeah, that's fire. Okay. We got positive reactions. That's real reactions, not actors. These are not paid actors. All right. They are real. We would have let them. They would have told us. Yes, it is good. Um, okay. I play almost long, so. Let him know. Let him know your plate almost gone. <laughs> Dang, Kayla. I'm trying to be classy. I didn't want to just pick out. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm trying to take my time with it. But it's good. I'm going to take our redfish out now. Oh, man. Look at that. Look at that. Perfect. Like I told y'all when I was seasoning the redfish, it's on the half shell. This is how easy it comes off of that. Let me show you. Look at that. It comes right off the shell. There's nothing but meat right there, folks. Look at that. Nothing but meat.